Sarah is planting 36 bunches of daffodils in her garden. She wants to put them in rows of equal numbers of bunches. What are her options for arranging them? So let's come up with all the different ways that we can get 36. 1 times 36, 2 times 18, 3 times 12, 4 times 9, 5 doesn't work, and 6 times 6. So we meet in the middle. Remember to use pairs so that you don't drop any of the factors. So for example, 1 times 36, 2 times 18, and so on. So the different ways that we could line up these daffodils. Let's call our first column the number of rows. And our second column will be the number of daffodil bunches. So we could have just one row and all 36 are lined up, all 36 bunches of daffodils. Or we could have two rows and each row will have 18 bunches or three rows and each row will have 12 bunches, four rows with nine bunches, or six rows with six bunches. Or we could have um, nine rows with four bunches, 12 rows with three bunches, 18 rows with two bunches each, or 36 separate rows with one bunch in each row. So these are all her different options. Probably the best option if she wanted a square would be the 6 times 6, but she might want to have a different design in her garden. Thank you for watching Educator.com.